This is Mikey with Cinema Spice, and I'm here to show you the split preset. Now this is really easy to use, and it creates that RGB split or the chromatic aberration look. So you just grab the preset, you drag it and drop it on your footage, and from at this point, what you need to do is a couple of things. Because all footage is different sizes, you're going to need to come in here to the split position, and hit the reset to set it for the size of your footage, and then come in here where it's the color split select. And we've got red, green, blue, and depending on what look you want is what you're going to select here. So if I go to this red and it says source layer, I just select my own source layer, and then I can come in here and then move this around, and you can see we've got this kind of chromatic aberration. Let me turn that off and then go to the green and do the same thing. Now we've got kind of the green and magenta look. Let's switch over to the blue. And then we've got the blue and the yellow. I think I want to do the green and magenta. So from here, there's only two controls. We can have this position control. If I reset this, I can grab this point and no matter where I go, it's going to split in that direction. So if I go diagonally, it's going to go that way, that way, left and right. And there's also this auto scale. If I turn this off, it's going to keep it the same size. But as it as we split, you're going to see the black on the side because everything's shifting. So I turn on the auto scale and I make sure everything stays within the frame. So that is the split effect. And again, these are key frameable. So if I want to keyframe this position, then it's going to be on and it's going to be off. So that is the split effect from Cinema Spice. Check it out today at cinemaspice.net.